Welcome to Age Science. Gates are very important component of our home. We can control who can enter and who will not. In our own spinal cord, we have gates also. But how do they function? Suppose I am feeling pain in my shoulder. This sensation of pain will go to the spinal cord through millions of nerves. These nerves are like electrical connection in our household. First, after reaching the spinal cord, they will be sent towards our brain. Then only we can feel the pain. And during the process, this outward flow from spinal cord to our brain will be controlled by the gates. If the gates are wide open, then we will feel more pain. And if the gates are little bit open, we will feel less pain. In battlefield, our brave soldiers fight with severe wounds. And sometimes even a very small scratch would be very painful for us. Why is that? And how we can use this to hack the pain we feel during injection. I just hate injections. Perhaps you all have experienced this. But today I will show you a hack to reduce the injection pain. When we are under stress or tension, or when we feel bored, or we are less physically active, we feel more pain. This time I indulged myself by distracting the attention of my brain by coughing. And by doing this, I am making the gates narrower, which will send the sensation of pain of injection to my brain. And through the narrow gate, a little sensation or almost no sen sensation of pain of injection is actually traveling to my brain. The hack is, I will cough and then he will push the injection. Okay, let's do it. <coughs> See, it doesn't pain now and it's perfectly all right. This is gate control theory, which tells us that there are two signals going to our brain. First, I cough and second is the signal coming from this injection. But first, the sensation of coughing goes to my brain, which blocks this painful sensation of injection. Thanks for your time.